When it comes to packing, storing, and delivering apples, the apple industry has come a long way. I visited Jacob Whiteside at Washington Fruit to see how some amazing new equipment is improving the industry for safety and efficiency. Hey Jake, how's it going? Good, how you doing? I'm fine, man. Hey, thanks for having us over here. This is pretty cool. Yes. I mean, yes. we've seen a, a lot of uh, packing facilities in our days here on Washington Grown, but you guys are doing some new technology stuff, right? Yes. Tell me about the, the Spectrum. This is the Compact Spectrum, and we use this to grade the fruit. Okay. It has uh, the capability to take uh, 270 pictures per apple, and it's taking pictures for color, shape. Uh, we weigh the fruit for size, and it measures internal qualities. 270 pictures per apple? 270 pictures per apple. Oh, man. Now, how, how new is this tech? Uh, this tech is four years old. OK, so you're kind of on the cutting edge of this stuff. Yes. Now, what changes has this made to your overall process? Um, it's helped us reduce our staffing levels to where this will sort most of the fruit. And we use people, we use our staff, to put the fruit in the boxes. OK. Keeping their workforce stable and safe is a high priority of Washington apple growers. Using technology like the Spectrum also allows warehouses to ensure their customers are receiving the best apples possible. Bottom line, what's the driving force to having something like this in your facility? Consistency for your path okay. to meet your customers' expectations. So every time I get a tray of apples, I know every single one of those apples is like almost the same. Almost the same, it should be. All right, so this is the, the brain of it all? This is the brain of the operation. Oh, wow. This is where we look at each apple that's coming in and making sure that the machine is doing what it's supposed to be doing. So this is one apple? That's one apple. This is one apple? That's one apple. Each, each lane has three color cameras and two sets of infrared cameras. So we can look at the defects through those and it maps out the apple color and defects to decide which lane to drop it. I think the thing that's so amazing is how lightning quick this is all happening. I mean, it's just <laughs> nanoseconds. It's mind boggling. <laughs> yeah, like, just the, the, the engineers to come up with this stuff. And there's so many wow. different parts of the apple that they're looking at. They're looking at color, they're looking at shape, they're looking at defects, they're looking at internals, they're looking at so many different facets of it, and they're putting it in the right spot. Yeah. Well, man, I gotta tell you, every time I bite into an apple, I'm always appreciative of the work that you guys are doing for thank us. You. So, Keep thank biting you. Keep biting into them. Okay, I will. <laughs>